And we must find out if the Caterham could do any better. Off it goes again, and let's just see how quickly the Caterham gets off the line. It is like a little flea, this thing. Piles it into the first corner, locking up the brakes. Like the Veritas, the R500 has got no ABS or other electronic nonsense. Beautiful drift on the other side, just sliding it around Chicago. That is how this car should be driven. Have a hit now. Stig is so excited that it's flipped on the indicator. But he's really had so much fun out here. You really notice that bump on Hammerhead in a car as light as this. Only problem is that lack of weight can make it hard to get heated with the tyres on. This is a very cold day, remember. It is a two-litre Ford engine. Half the cylinders in capacity, the very test, but by God, it flies. Needs to the penultimate corner. Stig really on it now, loving every minute. Swings it through Gamble and across the line. Well, obviously, the big question is, did it go faster than the Veritas? Uh, in fact, it did go, go faster, quite a bit faster, quite, quite a lot faster, actually, quite a heck of a lot faster, because it's up here, 117.9!